All right, my lovelies. Let's see what's coming out these cards today. Now, I do hope everything is going well out there in La La Land. Let me see if I can find y'all an encouraging word to get you through this energy. Now, we still in the energy of the pink moon, y'all. Now, you got the man holding the coin and envy coming out here. Now, you know what? I really want to look at um, what the book has to say about envy. I really do. Even though, you know, it's self-explanatory. I just want to see what the book has to say. Now, we're going to take the top one. And leave this one here. Now, it do look like some type of victory. Now, it do look like you're going to get this situation in balance. Yeah, you got two, two, two here, boo. Two, two, two. Yeah. Now, I do like to look at envy as the ego. I really do. That's why I say I want to look at what the book has to say about it. Just to see. Just to see. You know... Waiting on your turn. Oh, I'm looking at two, and it says journey. Pack your bag. Now, maybe you need to pack your bag. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I turned to the page for something. Listen, and that was the first cause. I first words I see. That's what I read. Okay, let me see. Pack your bag. Now, maybe some of y'all about to get something unexpected, I want to say. I got something unexpected that came in the mail today from my sister-in-law. A belated birthday present. Now, this card shows a woman holding a huge pearl in one hand and a platter of coins and pearls in the other. She stands in a silver room looking out at the Garden City on the horizon. All right, we don't need all that. Now, she has a life of value already, but she ignores that and longs for a shiny prosperity she sees elsewhere. Instead of feeling happy and fulfilled, her desires for more only causes a deep sense of lack and dissatisfaction, and that energy shows in her dress. This card upright is telling you to let go of jealousy and acknowledge the blessings you already have in your life. Now is the time to shift your focus. After all, when you envy others, it's only it only attracts more to them, not you. Wow, I didn't know that. And it says, notice all that you have and thank the universe for it. If this card is near the appreciation card in your spread, the message is doubly important. However, it's not. It's next to the victory and the man holding the coin. And yin and yang. Which again, is my opinion of you getting that thing in balance. Yeah, I see it. I see it. I see wish fulfillment is coming your way, boo. It says, now is the time to move from the conscious of lack to one of value. With this shit, with this shift, all things change. Alright. Now that was the uh, reverse. Now let me see what's going on. Because I really think, and something told me to pull from affirmation deck. Yeah. And I just want you to look at the difference between her and her. Because your turn is coming, my dear. It really is. And look what I stopped on. Now, what is the man holding the corner? 
Now, again, you know, I don't think that this is something over, this envy. You know, uh, I actually had uh, somebody that uh, left a comment and they said that it was people hating on other people's um, prosperity. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I don't necessarily uh, feel that. Sometimes it's unconscious. You know, it's perception. You know. You know, the Matrix has always, has programmed us to always want more and more and more. And now we're here, you have self-worth coming out here. Because you already got everything that you need. You got your mind, your body, and your soul. And you start to remember exactly who you are. That's worth a whole lot more. Something that money and things can't buy. And when you begin to heal more, all those shiny things in the background, they don't have, they don't matter as much, you know? I want you to just think about the people that can't get up and walk to the front door, take a bath by themselves. You understand what I'm saying? Taking multiple pills and things of that nature. I mean, just think about it. How blessed you really are. I know. As long as you plant no seeds, boo. You gonna shine too. You gonna shine too. And I just said something about somebody might be getting some type of unexpected gift. Because I just received a little uh, birthday present in the middle of the day. Yeah. Once you start opening in yourself up, healing and being in gratitude, connecting to Mother Universe, she's going to be sending you all kinds of stuff. You know? But sometimes she got to wean us off the um, capitalist mindset. <laughs> Not saying that you ain't um, worthy of having nice things. And I don't want you to get that misconstrued, boo, because you are. But they just don't mean that much. You know? They don't validate you. Yeah. As long as you're taking the action to heal, you'll see. You'll see. You ever notice somebody that um, this common? They can have on a white t-shirt, a pair of jeans, and had the hair pulled back in the ponytail, and and be the this. Oh man, you know, this white t shirt, pair of jeans on, nothing's big, and this is cute as they want to be. It, it really don't take all that. You know what I'm saying? Not to say that that's the end all be all, your outside appearance and how you carry yourself and your dress. You know, but listen, a broom and a mop go a long way. <laughs> People live in a project, have some of the nicest houses, apartments. They got houses, too. I'm just saying. Listen. You know, people talk a lot of trash about people that live in the project, but the houses on the, on the side of the project sometimes look worse than the ones inside. I'm, I'm just trying to say, y'all. I'm just trying to say. Mm-hmm. But these are projects got uh, around the clock a maintenance man. You, you have one of these slumlords in these hoods. <laughs> listen, listen. I'm just trying to tell y'all. It ain't what you got. It's how you take care of. That's right. It looked like he come in the battle, baby. It took a long time for it to come out there, but it came. Right here on Envy. The self. 
coming about that mindset. Opening up your heart. That little bird. Singing your own thing. Doing your own thing. The invitation to life. The yin and yang. The yin and yang to be in gratitude, boo. Now, it could be some other type of grat- um, invitation that's going on. Could be. Yeah. These two folks right here might be coming together. Now, that could just be you and you. I like to say that, you and you. <laughs> yeah. Alright, let's just let's go a little further. I know I said I was going to do it short, but let me see. What's the man holding the coin? Got all these hearts up here. Every, every last one of them up here got a heart. And all the cars don't have hearts. And all of them do. Every last one of them. And look how it went. From self-worth to the self. You know? Yeah. Man holding the coin. You got it all. a new portal, a new thought, wisdom, perspective. 28, there's another man right there <laughs> with self-worth. Look like you got a lot of self-worth going on right there, boo. <laughs> Look like you're bearing it all. On the other man. Going on, there's a lot of masculine energy going on out here now. Look, maybe this is why this is here because this is the number 28 and this is the number 28. Somebody coming to give you some flower, some type of invitation. Mm-hmm. Now, in the other, um, reading, yeah, something coming. I just feel it in my bones. It's going to knock your little socks off. Yep, some type of message with that invitation. 27. I'm pretty sure it got something to do with that. Now, this could be any type of collaboration. But I think the whole gist going on here is to be open. In regards to what the universe has to offer you. Yeah. That's probably why his shirt is open. It ain't got to be no more than that. <laughs> and I'm just looking at the card. Now, she is in a state of envy, but look what's behind her. If she just opened up her eyes and turn around and look. a document i am a message i am information i am a package sometimes i can be in a voice invoice 
a certificate, or a test result. You can find me as your mail, a newsletter, or an award. Look around me to find out more of what I am learning, leaning towards. Balance, invitation to life, yin and yang, that relationship. Some type of invitation. Look at all the hearts. Mm-hmm. Fun, adventure, joy, hope, beauty, love, kindness, and the calm. She looks very calm. And look at what's showing up. And then you got the door to abundance. I like it. Wow. Spirit just told me to pay attention to this. 4 3 2. It's lining up, boo. It's lining up. It's lining up. Yeah. And you got 28 and 27 and 12 with that other dope. Yeah. Which is 1, 2, 3, 4. <laughs> There you go. Now, this could be crushing. Somebody crushing on you. I keep seeing that. Some type of offer. And look what's there. Manifestation. Judgment. Something that's finalized. Now you got the um, five on self worth looking at this cup. Now let me see. But we do have the death card here on the self and the king of cups. Now look at the elevation from envy. Hey, yes. And I think this is just you pouring into your own cup. Man. What's self-worth? Now, this could even mean this. The change. Understanding your worth. Now, he's still a little sexy right there, but he ain't all like that right there. <laughs> Something might be going on in that area as well. Just saying, y'all. A little modesty. Communication with that invitation, that letter. I think I'm gonna put these like this. I don't know why I gotta make it even in my view, even though I could have just kept went right down, but I don't know. It's just weird, child. Listen. I got problems. <laughs> Yeah. Failing to see what's in front of your face. Or oh, this is something new coming your way. Mm-hmm. Missed opportunity. And that's an offer in that regards. 
with that man holding the coin. Now, it could, I, I want to say that this man holding the coin is you. Yeah. I think this is a little self-talk in regards to, uh, how you thinking? About feeling left out in the cold. Black. This was all down here about balance all these twos. And that's what justice indicates. You can also see uh, justice as my yacht. She is all about balance, giving and receiving. This is the year all about receiving your rewards, y'all. This is what it's all about. All the seeds that you plant. Spring just begun. All right. Wish fulfillment. On that death and that rebirth, the self, the wisdom, the door. Listen. There you go. Something new. For the wounded warrior. Now, I do see a lot. You could be seeing 999, of course. But it's just so much synchronicity, alignment. emotions, bringing that thing into balance, pouring in your own cup, that collaboration with Mother Universe, the source, the, yeah, you're doing it. You are doing it. Writing a love letter to yourself, writing a love letter to the universe. You might be saying white feathers. Now, we have 27, 28, 22, 20, 43, you could be all those ages. However, you can be a life path number four, two, three, one, nine, five, eight. The four. Right here, which is stability on this communication. And that is that invitation. Because this does indicate invitations. Marriages, jobs, everything that this card said. It's all in there. It it this is everything. This is eleven eleven. All right. We're going to close it up with balance. Moving forward. You see it? That's you, boo. Coming into balance. Everything is working out in divine timing. And I know we get tired of hearing that right there, but that's what it is. <laughs> now, I'm going to put, uh, let me see. Let me give you something different. Something, something different. Something different. Something a little encouraging. Let's pull from these. Yeah, you got to go on a journey. A 
adventure. What's the advice for it? Ascend. Right here on that self worth. Transcend, my darling. Raise those vibrations. Recognize how beautiful you are. It's almost like the same person. Right here on self worth. That's gorgeous. And we got two cards stillness and gratitude. <laughs> and potential is at the bottom of the deck. Now, the spirit is so funny. Because this is what it was all about. Wasn't it reading all about gratitude? Mm -hmm. Alright, boo. That's your message. Follow the channel so I keep you up to date.